Uh, okay, let's check out this Jack trailer. So much stuff happening. It's crazy late, and we haven't even had a chance to really uh, dive deep into this. Jack is probably the character I have seen and know the least about in the entirety of the, 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 the tech-on, right? So uh, I'm curious how they're going to change him, what his gimmick is going to be, because he already looks like a walking 1980s Betamax player. So I don't know if Jack's ever going to be the character for me, but he's the staple of Tekken. He's been there since the first one. And um, see how different he is. They shrunk his booty? Oh, no. They shrunk his booty? That sounds bad. Get ready for the next battle. That doesn't sound like what people want out of Jack. Look at this dude. New Jack, <laughs> Jack 8, here we go. <laughs> He's flying in. Whoa, whoa, Stompy? Huh? Uh. Interesting. <laughs> what is this buff pose looking thing? Huh? Check it running in. Dude, he, he he flexes and gets like Zangief armor. Oh my god. Yeah, he has like Gigas stuff, right? Did they stick Gigas and Jack? Well, that's a fantastic super. Well, that's a fantastic super. Holy shit. <laughs> Here's my Sunday best. Proton, protein cannon. <laughs> um... Yeah, it, I, it, there was definitely like this big thing he did against the wall absolutely looked like Gigas stuff, right? And it's funny because Gigas wasn't Jack historically. Gigas always felt like he was the replacement for Marduk before Marduk eventually showed up in Tekken 7. And it's funny to give not Marduk some of those moves, right? I don't know how much, because obviously I haven't fought against a Gigas and Jesus, I don't know. 2018 maybe 2017 what the hell was that stomp stuff second review he was doing like off the ground weird what huh once again a good first impression because we're seeing jack do wild stuff i never saw jack do you know with his leg and his army goes he never did that solid mid bullshit that you literally have been seeing this character do this for the past like 30 years never saw him do that i'm assuming he has it but i never saw him do it you know what i mean shut up what the hell is this a low it was dude look at this low and wait a minute wait a minute he does the jump, he does like a muscle flex after, and then he goes in for attacks with the hit stun? Dude, what the shit? This looks scary as fuck. It's like a Jinpachi thing. Yeah, it's like, it's like Jinpachi's wild bullshit that he has. Yeah, this is... Very much looking like some, a, a little bit of what's going on here is like Gigas, right? Not, not a ton. I'd have to, I'd have to go back and look at Gigas moves, to be honest. You know what? I think he's looking pretty cool, right? I, I like this, um, I like his like darker design where he's, uh, he doesn't have like the usual, like, you know, camo pants on and all that kind of stuff and the big boots. I 
like that there's a different sound for him hitting the opponent than the other characters, right? Yeah, the visor is not great, but I like the the sound effects of his attacks. They feel like metal metal clanking against your skull. Okay, so heat stuff. What's the heat ender? Do you have a heat ender? That's, there it is. And there it is. So this is the heat engager, right? And then it runs in. God damn, what the dumb shit. What is going on here? What is this force field shit? Okay, it's a heat engager. And then he, what? He can flex and like power crush? Dude, this scary as shit. This looks terrifying. Does Jack have this kind of stuff? Have I not fought enough against enough Jacks? I know it's like, this character is not a super popular character. He really isn't. Does he, he does not, right? I don't, I don't see Jack like flexing and absorbing attacks and things like that. What the hell? He has a stance that absorbs attacks now. Murray mentioned it. Okay. Okay. So this is new. Jack players exist. Well, it's pretty much Anakin, you know, being the number one Jack representer. So this is already in heat, it looks like right after here. Yeah, I think he's already heated up because he's running forward after. Jesus, that ender. Buddy. It needs to be Japan Evo already. It's seriously. Gigas had like a flex absorbing move. Okay. So we're seeing amalgamations of some characters, right? We're seeing devil Jin stuff stuck with Jin. We're seeing uh, devil or devil stuff specifically mixed in with Kazuya, which has, you know, uh, been there with, with Rage Drive or yeah, yeah, right. Rage Drive from before. And now Jack 8 is getting, you know, Gigas style stuff becoming a uh, Giga Jack. <laughs> Giga Chad Jack. This is all making Tekken look very fresh, right? If they can make a trailer for easily one of the most uninteresting characters in Tekken, 100%. Jack is easily one of the least interesting characters. I was explaining that like, man, what's the next character we're gonna get? Like, you know, Yoshimitsu, that's probably the last one from default Tekken that we haven't even seen. I literally forgot that Jack existed. My ass forgot that this guy, oh, that's right. There's a huge ass robot dude. that looks like Arnold Schwarzenegger running around. Forgot his ass existed. And the fact that they were able to make a trailer that is captivating and interesting, where it's like analyzing what's going on and what this new wild shit is and it looks wild and crazy, that's actually dope, right? That's actually super dope.